This recording will continue on group action on a set X. The two key points of this video are the definition of fixed of G or X sub G and the example based on John Farley's text 16.8 and exercise 16.1. What is a fixed set of G? If a group G acts on a set X, then for each element G of the group G here, the fix of G is all the element X in the set X here, such that G cap X is equal to X. This expression looks very similar to the stabilizer, but we are looking for element in the set X now. In John Farline's text, it is denoted by X sub G. I'm going to use an example found in 16.8 when D4 X on the set X where X is taken from the square. D4 is a symmetry group of a square including row 0, row 1, row 2, row 3 which are rotation anti-clockwise 0 degree, 90 degree, 180 degree, 270 degree about the center of a square respectively where mu1 is a vertical reflection, mu2 is a horizontal reflection, delta1 is a reflection in diagonal in the line d1 and delta2 is a reflection in the line d2 and x is taken from the square consists of four vertices 1, 2, 3, 4 and four sides s1, s2, s3, s4 and two diagonal d1 and d2 now let's look at the fixed row 1 remember row 1 is rotation of 90 degree and d clockwise about the center of the square since we know rotation will fix the center of the rotation Unfortunately, the center of the rotation is not in the set X, so therefore, the fix of row 1 is empty. Now, if you look at fix of row 2, now row 2 is a rotation of 180 degree. So, if you try to figure out what are the elements inside the set such that after rotation of 180 degree, you still get back the same. Now this time, it is not empty. Beside the center of the square, which is not inside the set X, we find that D1 and D2 will remain fixed after you rotate 180 degree about the center of the square. The rest of the element S1, S2, S3, S4, and vertices 1, 2, 3, 4 will not be fixed by row 2. Now let's look at another fixed set. Fix on mu1, where mu1 is a reflection in a vertical line bisecting the square. What element will be fixed after this reflection? Well, we know that S3 will be fixed after this reflection. You can see from the diagram, S3 will be fixed after reflection. And similarly, S1 will be fixed after this reflection. The rest of the side and diagonal and the vertices will not be fixed. Now let's look at another fixed set, fix of delta 1, where delta 1 is a reflection in the line along D1. So which element of the set X will be fixed by delta 1? Obviously, D1 will be fixed by delta 1. Now, D2 is this line. When you do a reflection in D1, then the line D2 will be fixed by delta 1. So, D2 is another element of the set which are fixed by delta 1. 
other than that, the rest of the size S1, S2, S3, S4, and vertices 1, 2, 3, 4 are not fixed by delta 1. This is the end of the recording.